So we're here uh, at uh, the Beehive entrance. You can see it right there. And we're gonna head up uh, Beehive to uh, a couple of different spots on top, and then we're gonna drop down the Ellensburg side. And uh, so yeah, it should be good, some good trails. Uh, a few of our favorite technical areas are on this, so we're gonna hit that. We have with us the white Jeep with Mikhail and Asta, our Jeep, and Greg and Lori, and mom and dad in the yellow Jeep. And along with them is my aunt Sandy and uncle Jim. And so they're coming along with us for the ride. So yeah, it's gonna be a good, uh, good trip and more to come. You know the real reason we go in the hills? It's not because we want to have all these adventures. It's the only thing that puts the caution to sleep. <laughs> So um, this road's a bit slicker than we kind of anticipated, which is okay. Uh, so we just decided, all of us, that we're gonna air down a little bit further. We're gonna take a couple more pounds out, two or three more pounds out, and help us uh, be a little more secure on the road. Should be good. Um, I, I like the snow. I think this is great. This is, this is a perfect start to our winter season. So we'll see how it goes. Oh yeah, it was fun. Andrew goes, man, I should have filmed that. And I was like, yeah, you should have. I think they're turning around. He's safe driving down. Oh yeah, but I mean, we can always put the front winch on something. Sorry, say that one more time. We're sliding and it's an edge. We need some help. You need some help? Um, yeah, we have an edge and we just slid and we're we're safe, but we're gonna need some help. All right. All right.
just sliding. I mean, I think with every track, every vehicle that goes down, it's just packing it and turning it into ice. Uh, and I, I, I came down in neutral because if I put it in drive, it just. Well, I, I, I don't even notice it. I mean, I just, I just drove down. Well, we can hear the brakes were like popping, you know. This one, it, it was sliding like tweaking us to the edge. Did you do that on purpose? Uh, well, because we were going towards the edge, I was trying to get it away from it, and so we went into the bank. Yeah. I'm gonna try airing back up. Uh, because it's fine balance. If you get too wide, they become like, they can become skis. Because in less pounds per square inch. If they're narrower, your tires are narrower, you get better traction because you have more weight in one spot. And it's just one of those that's just right there at that. So I think I'll go back up. With it being so slick, do we need to kind of link together or that's strap together? I, I like, well, I'm afraid because you can't, you just pull each other off. Oh. That's the problem. Mm -hmm. you have chains I, well, I do. I've got four, two, two sets of chains, but they're at home. Oh, oh no! no. <laughs> they didn't throw me I don't know that we have chains though either. Like we don't have chains, do we? Chains though? No, I didn't think so. To a tree, and then and then pull yourself in as you go down the hill, and then go to the next tree. Because that would that would keep you on the road. It just pulled you on the road. I just I don't want to go into the bank. I don't want to go off. No, I know. That's why I said the dad stick to the. To the bank here, like well, I couldn't. I just kept. It down. was pulling us to onto the side. Yeah. And that's what was freaking. Yeah. Guess. Well, I, right. everybody mm -hmm. I didn't have any problem going up. Well, we were having problems going up. We kept like the back. I don't know. That's but coming down, it just doesn't. So I'm going to air back up to 18 and just try that. See if that helps. Without her, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Sorry, press do it. Nice, that's oh, But he is sliding. Oh, he, is sliding he, is. he is. He is. But he's rolling with it. He's not. Yeah. He's mm -hmm. not stopping. He just keeps going. But you've got the narrowest tires, which are best on ice. Oh, oh no.
So I guess our plan didn't turn out how we wanted it. I guess that's not really out of the ordinary for us. But anyways, we decided uh, because of the issues that um, the ice kind of happening underneath the little bit of snow that was there, it was probably more, um, or I should say it was smarter, wiser, for us to kind of not push forward through it, uh, but instead kind of come down and go do something else instead. Uh, maybe when there's more snow on the ground and the ice is fully covered over, that would be totally fine because then we can just snow creep across the top of that and not have to worry about the underlying uh, ice that is present there quite a bit. And it makes sense because recently it's been raining a bunch and then it all of a sudden dropped in temperature and that rain became snow. So all that rain would have turned into quite a bit of ice on the road and it just hadn't quite snowed enough. So now we're gonna head down and we're gonna go and uh, check out another spot. Hopefully we'll make it to this one. Uh, it is, it's called Stefan's Pond and that way we'll still be able to get some scenery, get a little bit of a drive in. But it was still fun. Uh, we got to do sort of another recovery. Uh, Asta had kind of got turned sideways on the hill and he didn't want to mess with it too much because it was kind of in a precarious position. And it was safe he, to uh, call for the assistance as opposed to try to pull himself out of it. All right, so we're gonna go check out Stefan's Pond and uh, any other little fun side things to do on the way to that. Thanks for watching and please subscribe.